The All Progressive Congress Caretaker Extraordinary Convention Planning Committee, led by Governor Mimala Abuni of Yobe State, was constituted on June 28, 2021. After the sack of former Governor Adams Oshomole led National Working Committee, NWC, the committee was mandated to conduct a national convention that will meet wife a new leadership for the ruling party within a six months time frame. The convention, however, is yet to be conducted with the committee, having its six months tenure extended twice. This development, no doubt, may have informed insinuations from various quarters within the APC that the Buni-led caretaker committee is scheming to serve out a shameless tenure, which would have expired in June next year. Putting the record straight, a chieftain of the APC, Patrick Obayegong, at a news conference in Abuja, dismissed such claims as fake news. Today, the committee stands high, and the party and its entire membership globally are proud of the feats the committee has achieved, though we are also aware of efforts by a few who differ on the performance of the party under the committee's watch. But that again is democracy. For agreements and disagreements are necessary, are necessary ingredients that overawe and masturbate any democratic ethos and democratic space, provided such agreements and disagreements must be seen to be devoid of cranky ploys and political delinquency. The Edo state-born politician who also raised concerns about series of litigations the impasse may have generated, however, poured encomiums on the achievement recorded by the CECPC. And just the backdrop of the magnitude and plenitude of the reconciliation drive and backed upon by the, C by the C CECPC, the fortunes of the party in the last year has greatly improved across the country and especially in the southeast and south-south, which has been the stronghold and bastion of political opposition in the past. He further called for calm, indicating reasons why members of the ruling party must work together, especially ahead of the 2023 general elections. CNA News.